hey guys, um, I thought um, since there's another Lou Reed song I can think of off the top of my head, I'm, I'm here, might as well go ahead and just make one more. Um, the thing about this song is, um, I guess the hardest part about this one, again, is playing in the, in the key. Um, which, you know, down tuned, eh, just gonna do it in standard. <clears throat> so, Andy's Chest, this is one from Transformer, Get Transformer, God, it's such a good album, I mean, it is ridiculous, every song is great. So, song starts out, E, A. And I mean, that's it. Just the, basically, what you'll say is, um, this song is sort of like, um, it's almost like three, three different chord progressions with verses, almost. Um, I guess, I guess you could say the third one, the third progression is sort of like a chorus. So, start out, first section is just E, and then go into an A. So every line, it's just that one chord. So, uh, if I could be anything in this world that flew, I would be a bat and come swooping after you. And the last time you were here, things were a bit askew. And that's it. That's the first verse uh, section. That's, that's all you need, just E and A. Now, of course, you know, you're going to want to put a little uh, put a little personality into it since you don't have a lot going on with the chords. Next part, we're going to do F, C, G. Good, good set of chords right there. F, C, and G go together so nice. All right, so next line. Well, you know what happens after dark. Rattlesnakes lose their skins and their hearts And all the missionaries lose their bark That's it, that's that part And then the next part I call the chorus And it's going to be D, G, and A oh, All the trees are calling after you And all the venom snipers after you. Or all the mountains boulder after you. Then you go back to the EA. You're just doing that section again. Or that that uh that progression rather, you know. And uh on the album version, you know, do what you want, man. If you're covering a song, put your put your own stamp on it by all means. But on the album, they kind of get a little bit more intense with it. This, the the first verse is sort of just the like introduction to the way the song is going to sound, and then after that, they kind of belt it out um, and get really uh, get really loud with it. But for the most part, it's the same thing, same uh, same type of deal going on there. The only difference is the last chorus is going to be. Um, kind of an extended version of the D, G, A progression. And then at the end, there's kind of a funny little timing where he's saying swoop, swoop, rock, rock. And it's kind of like, um, let me see here. Rock, rock. Swoop, swoop. Rock, rock. Kind of like that. That's, that's pretty much it, man. That's, uh, that's, that's the whole song, you know. You want to learn all the lyrics, uh, you, can, you know, you can Google them or whatever. But I know that I have, um, I, I like watching people play the songs instead of just looking up chords online. And I just find this to be a lot easier and quicker way to learn music. So, uh, Andy's Chest, Lou Reed, he's got a million good songs. Just listen to as much Lou Reed as you can, dude. It'll make you a better person. See you later.